In this video, I'll show you two examples on how to find the antiderivative of double angle trigonometric functions such as sine 2x, cosine 2x, etc. Let's start with question one. In question one, they're asking us to find the integral of sine 2x dx. To find the integral of this function, you have to set u as 2x. So we'll be using u substitution here. We'll take the derivative where we end up with du is equal to 2 dx. And we'll solve for dx where we have dx is equal to half du. Essentially what I did is I divided both sides by 2, giving us half du. The next step is to rewrite this in terms of u and du, where we have sine u times half du. I'm going to pull out this half. I end up with 1 over 2 on the outside. And the integral of sine u, the antiderivative, is actually equal to negative cosine u plus c. So instead of writing this integral symbol here, I just found the antiderivative. So I'm going to replace that with simply negative cosine and no need for this u anymore. I'm going to replace it with 2x plus c. My final step is to multiply this half inwards where I end up with negative half cosine 2x plus c. You don't need to multiply this half into this c. This doesn't matter. Let's move on to question two, another very similar example. This time I'm going to set my u equal to 6x. Taking the derivative here, I end up with du is equal to 6 dx. Therefore, dx is equal to du over 6. Replacing this into my integral, I end up with cosine u. And this dx is now replaced with du over 6. Pulling out this 1 over 6, I end up with the following times du. Now, cosine u has the antiderivative of simply sine u. So I'm going to replace all of this with 1 over 6 bracket sine u. I don't need to use u anymore. I can replace it with the 6x because the du is gone plus c. Multiplying this 1 over 6 into the bracket, I end up with 1 over 6 sine 6x plus c. And there you have it. Two examples on how to find the antiderivative of double angle trigonometric functions. If you found this tutorial helpful, please support our channel by subscribing or by liking this video. If you have any further questions, visit our website at studyforce.com. We're an online service for students seeking free homework help. See you soon.